Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 41 of my FIFA 15 Derby County career on the Xbox One. First game update is Midlands Derby. Derby face Aston Villa. We are at the iPro Stadium. We've got the home advantage. There's a team going into this game. We've got Ibarbo and Sonogo up front for the Rams. And let's see if we can get the three points. Not a too bad of a start of the season so far. Uh, some of the players getting into form early on in the season, which is good news. Trying to get Victor Ibarbo on the score sheet a lot more. That's what we're struggling with right now, scoring goals. And Aston Villa are going on the early attack here. And there it goes out for a goal kick to Derby. So 20 minutes gone and still goalless. Cyrus Christie playing it forward there to Ibarbo. And Sonogo losing out, unfortunately. Ron Vlaat tidying up, but... Uh, Derby County winning the ball again. And here's Ibarbo powering his way all the way through. A chance here to go 1-0 ahead. And goalkeeper, great save. A good chance there for Ibarbo to put the ball in the back of the net. But the goalkeeper came rushing out, keeps it out. And it's a corner to the Rams. Cross comes in. Head up. Again, the goalkeeper there holding on to it. And the score remains. Derby nil. Aston Villa nil. Good couple of chances there for Derby. And we've got just under 10 minutes remaining in this first half. The Rams once again in possession, pushing forward. And here is a Barbo yet again. Nice little ball there. Finds Angel Correa. And he's going all the way through himself. Oh, why didn't he hit it? He took that extra touch. And the goalkeeper yet again, who's the man of the match so far, came rushing out. And he gets his hands on the ball. So into the final minutes of the game. As you can see, it was a much quieter second half than it was the first. Well, can we steal it late on? Here's Will Hughes. Serge Nabry tries to cross. Go on, hit it. No, Aston Villa get it away. And there goes the final whistle. It ends Derby nil, Aston Villa nil. We had a few chances there to win that game, but we only come out with a point. So we're going to change things up for the next game. Only slightly, only slightly. Still got Snuggo and Ibarbo up front starting. Who are we playing, actually? We've got Southampton next up. They are one place above us in the Premier League right now. So, we could do with the victory, please. We're away from home. Southampton, tough place to go. And we've got Angel Correa and Will Hughes in the middle. Snogo, Ibarbo up front. Jordan Ibe on the left side. Serge Nabry on the... Sorry, Jordan Ibe on the left side. Jordan... Uh, bleh. Serge Nabry on the right side. There we go. We'll get it out eventually. Southampton then to kick this game off. Who's going to come out the victors? Hopefully Derby do. We've won the ball early on there. Almost did at least. Southampton with Rodriguez. And he loses the ball. Loses it to Angel Correa. Who plays a through ball. Chance here for Derby. Then three minutes in. It's the Barbo shoot. Good save by the keeper. Could only parry it out. But Southampton with Schneiderlin managed to get it clear. So score remains 0-0. Southampton losing possession there. Angle Crew yet again winning the ball for Derby County. He plays through ball to Snogger who shoots. Goalkeeper couldn't hold on to it, but he does eventually. And again, a good save by the keeper. Two chances then for Derby in the first 20 minutes. Can we keep possession? Go for another chance. Ball over the top. Snogger again. Get in near post. And we do finally take the lead. Snogo had a good chance a second ago, but he finally gets the ball. I think it was from Ibarbo who played it over the top. Nice, conf nice control from Yoyo Sonogo. Yeah, Ibarbo plays it over the top. There's a control with the chest. And he just pokes it past the outrushing keeper to make it Southampton 0. Derby County 1. So into the final couple of minutes we go. And we're looking good for the three points here. If we can just hold on, not concede. And it's going to go for a Southampton free kick then in the final minute. A late substitution as well. Yoshida's come on for target for the Saints. Free kick comes in. Far post, header, and goalkeeper Jack Butland holds on to it well. And he's going to play a short one here. Well, it was going to be a short one. It's gone close enough to the halfway line. Here's Serge Nabry pushing forward. Got two in the area now. Gets the cross in. Header, go on. No, goalkeeper holds on to it, and the score remains 1-0. Derby County get the three points. A good victory away from home. And look at this. We have got Bayern Munich next up. This is the fourth game of the Champions League group stage. We are currently bottom of the league. Well, bottom of the group stage. Um, but we're all on equal points, I think, or close to. So if we can win this, it'll be a big victory. In Munich, against Bayern Munich. And it's going to be Bayern Munich to kick the game off. Van Persie's there for Bayern. And Schweinsteiger now. 
And here is Robin. No, it's Lewandowski. I thought that was Van Persie for a second. Come on, goalie. Goalkeeper holds onto it. And it's going to be a free kick early on for Bayern Munich. And Robin Van Persie is the man that's going to step up to take this. Can they take the lead early on? He's going for a shot. Shoots way over. Not even troubling the goalkeeper whatsoever. And after three and a half minutes, it's still nil-nil. Bayern Munich still in possession now, though. Ten minutes played. Derby, get it clear. New Barbo. Now, Angel Korea. Look at his fast little feet. Plays it forward. A chance here for Alex, who starts ahead of Sonogo. Oh, just wide. Unlucky. A good chance there to give the Rams the lead. 13 minutes gone. Still nil-nil. Alex with the early shot there. So, it's going to be a goal kick to Bayern Munich. Played forward. And Munich keep possession. Less than 20 minutes played. Lewandowski now for Bayern. Here's Robin Van Persie. Muller. And that's a poor pass. Derby County getting it back. Alex. Go on, Obaba. Use your pace. Is through. A chance here for Derby County to take lead. It's Victor Obaba. Oh, no. He's put it wide. Is Obaba's first name even Victor? I don't even know. Why did I say Victor? But anyway, if it is, then that was a good call. If not, then I don't know why. But Obaba missed a chance there anyway to give Derby County the lead. Can we keep it in? No, it's gone out. So, kicking off the second half are Derby County. Still, nil-nil. Here's Jordan Ard for the Rams. Rushing down his left side. Going for an early attack here, Derby. And here's a Barbo now. He's got some space. Shoots. Shoots and scores. He shot straight across the keeper. Goalkeeper didn't even move. And Derby County had taken lead straight from kickoff in the second half. It's now Bayern Munich nil. Derby County won. Victor Obaba got the space there. Opened it up. Got the shot off. And it is. That is his first name. Victor Obaba. I was right. And we're on the attack again with 10 minutes to go. A good chance here for Jordan Ivey. Shoots. Shot blocked. And cleared away. It's going to go out for a Derby County throw in. Can we double the lead? It would be fantastic if we could. Be a good result as well for Derby. Going to make a late change here. Um, who's going to change? Ruben Neves is a little bit tired. So we'll shove him off. And put Torres on. Van Pollen on the left side. Is our youngster. And then Snogo can go up front in place of Ibarbo. Uh, Robin's coming on for Bayern Munich in place of Dante, I think it was, who went off. Three changes then for Derby County. It was Dante who went off for Bayern Munich. And there's Alex crossing, far post. Unlucky, it's just headed away there. And Bayern Munich maybe with a chance to attack. And Alex on the ball for the Rams. We've got just over a minute to play. And he's through here. Cross, oh, shot even. Unlucky, good save by the keeper and cleared away. It's going to go out for a Derby County throw. Still putting the pressure on late here, the Rams. And here's Serge Nabry, takes the throw in. And go Korea, keeping the possession there for Derby. Torres, Van Pollen's open here. Good control, hits it and it's gone in. The youngster on that left side of midfield, he cut in. And he got on the end of the ball. He's just come on as a substitute as well. And he's double Derby's count, Derby County's lead in the last minute of the game. It's a nice little chip over there by Alex, I believe it was. And the goalkeeper did get to it, but he couldn't keep it out. And it's Stefano Van Pollen with his first Champions League goal for Derby. Giving us a two-goal lead. And now we're just waiting for that final whistle to blow. And this will be a big, big win for us. We've got two games remaining in the Champions League. And run the attack in. Can we make it three? Snogo crossing. Unlucky. Defender got there ahead of him. And there is a final whistle then. Bayern Munich nil. Derby County two. Big three points there for us in the Champions League. But in the league right now, in the BPL, we are sitting in fourth place. Just two points off top. So we're not doing too bad. We need to be scoring more goals. Some of them there at the bottom with only two points. Nottingham Forest and Newcastle. Also in the bottom places for relegation. We're already out of the Capital One Cup. Got knocked out early on, unfortunately. The Copa Europe, we won by Real Madrid, beating Leverkusen 3-1. And let's have a quick look at our group stage in the Champions League then. Yeah, Real Madrid, top of their group. Chelsea third in their group. Roma sitting top, PSG top of theirs. Spurs in second place. PSV bottom of theirs, that's a bit of a surprise. Man City in second. And there we are, bottom of our group. We've played four games and we are all on five points. We've all won one, drew two and lost one. 
So it's going to be an interesting final two games of the group. Thanks for watching guys, if you like the video please hit like, comment if you want to below and don't forget to hit that subscribe button, peace!